Welcome back. This is Mohammad Meran, and today we are going to see how we can create email template. As in the previous video, we have created the letter head for email template. In this video, we are going to see how we can create the email template. So let's get started. This is our Salesforce org. You can see a gear icon setup. You can click on that. Click on setup. So yeah, type here email templates. So as you can see, I can find classic email template. Click on it. After clicking, you can see there is a radio button new template. Click on it. So there are different types of email templates you can create. Text is a very like only text will be there you cannot like uh, add anything in this images and all so html using classic letterhead as we have previously like discussed about the classic letterhead we have created the letterhead so that letterhead we can include in this html template and this is the custom without like using the letterhead so for example we have a html and we want to do it by a custom right so then we will use it and we are going to see this also how we can create this so uh, now we are going to create html with letterhead because we have already created the letterhead right so let's get started click next <coughs> you can see here in which folder you want to do this is personal email templates folder in the sense only it will be usable for you this is public classic email template will be visible for everyone and this is the npsp email template visible for the non-profit success pack right so i'll click on the unified public classic templates and i have to check the inbox for the available for use i can give the name of the template i'll say service template service template and then the unique name will pop populated and i can uh, like created whichever the letterhead is that in the system which I created I can choose that thing I will choose whichever I created that is wonderful right and then the email layout it should be free form right it can be formal it can be promotional newsletter products so I am using a free form letter and then I should give the description of that I'll just give it same service template if you want but subject you can give it here you can give it same right I'll just click next so yes we have got our so in this thing we are going to enter our content right so this subject will be presented here we can add the subject over here yeah i have added right so for example i this wh why we are using template is for example when we have the requirement to send the email not only to a single person to thousands of people right then sending the same information one by one consume the time and productivity decreases so to increase the productivity and to save the time we have prepared the email template only with the few changes we can send the email within a click for all the users of us right so you no need to create again and again that so email templates have lot of time increases the productivity and in turn it increases for so it saves lot of time for us so in this we can do one more thing is uh, we can add the like fields right what is that field is in the sense every time a user we are going to send his name or his uh, like contact number or his email we want automatically to be feeded in the system that also we can achieve here that also saves a lot of time and it gives a lot of productivity for our work just we can click here and which are the fields i want to add for example i want to add contact fields so i want their name right so i'll search for the name and you can see here there is a value populated copy it and paste it here right you can paste it here and then every time a contact you're going to send his name will be auto populated so you don't need to type his name over there right so if you for example if you want any other fields also you can select from here 
like date field uh, or any other field all of the fields are available and in that particular field you can select like uh, whichever you want to uh, like use you can use it right for example i'll select contact fields uh, here one second yeah so see so many fields are there here you can select the birth date contact id you can select uh, email you can select the phone home uh, phone number also will be auto populated in the system if it is saved so many things you can select within a click of a button that is the beauty of salesforce crm right so this way i can do it and customize as you can see my letterhead has also been populated with the email logo here which we have created earlier i'll just save it next and then i need to copy whatever the same i have produced we'll ask yes and see it came here right so i'll click save then successfully i am able to see that my email template is already have been created so we'll do one thing we're going to uh, go to our org and we'll test it out okay we'll go to our org we'll go to contacts we'll go to my contact yes so there is a activity tab here you can click on the email then you can enter the subject right after that you can copy the signature is already been populated you can click here insert or create template click insert template and it will ask for the folder click on the classic email templates right so i have created now service template click on that yes inserting as you can see my template has been come here the values which are i added you can see it is auto populating the contact name right so i no need to type the contact name again and again for thousand records means it becomes hectic and more time consuming and productivity reduces so increase the increasing the productivity and time and saving the time is really a good thing so this way i can do it i can send the mail so this way i can use my uh like html template what about if for example we want to customize it in our own way right we want like images there and in that images uh, we want a uh, link to be shared and so many other things right so how can i achieve that we'll see it so before that this is for the html template <coughs> how to create a html template and with a letterhead right so there is a, another option also without template without little how we can clear the template so we'll see in the upcoming next video stay tuned thank you so much for watching this